Hello everyone, welcome to another video on my channel. But I have a first question. How do you think about my new hair? Is this funny? <laughs> funny or something? <laughs> Alright, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to stick an arrow to a moving car in Filmora 11. Okay, so uh, let me give you some example. This is the first example. So we have a car and a moving arrow. And we have another example, which is uh, also a beautiful arrow. Follow the car. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. All right, so now I'm on my computer screen. And being mentioned that if you want to try Filmora, I will put the link in the description for you. And if you want to purchase a lifetime license of Filmora 11, don't forget to use my 20% discount coupon code in the description also. Okay. Uh, so first thing first, we want to create a new project and we need to select the aspect ratio right here first. Let's select 16 by 9 for a YouTube video. And then I'm going to click this button to create a new project. All right. And the next thing, we want to import the footage that we want to use. By the way, I just use a stock media here. Just go to stock media and then go to my download folder. All right, so let's see where's my car. Okay, so this is a footage that I'm going to use for this example. Just try and drop it onto the timeline and let's play it. Uh, so I have many car here. By the way, I will follow this car, the red one. So just play it until the car go out the screen. All right, so at this position, I want to split the clip right here and then delete the rest so now we need to use the motion tracking feature in Filmora 11 to track the car so let's put it at the beginning okay just press home to bring the playhead to the beginning of the timeline and then we want to click this button motion tracking just click here and now we have a tracking point on the preview window just adjust the tracking point to the car all right something would look like this and then we want to click this button start tracking okay and wait a few seconds all right very nice so the software can track the car very well all right and the next thing we want to find the arrow that we want to stick on the car uh, to do that we all we need to do is to select the element tab right here and then you want to select this one the recommended folder and at the search box just type tutorial and press enter you know that in tutorial folder we have many different kind of arrow that we can select for our video okay so you see here there are many arrow by the way you can use any one this one okay just download this one just double click but you want to use any arrow it's up to you okay just drag and drop it onto the timeline and let's play the video to see where's the arrow okay so here's the arrow and the next thing we want to go back to the motion tracking of the video okay just double click at the video here on the timeline and now we need to click this button okay just select here and then select tutorial element this is the name of the arrow select it and now the next thing we want to adjust the arrow to the car okay just click at the arrow and then you can rotate it and put it right here and also you can resize it something like this okay and let's go to the beginning and let's preview the video first very nice all right so this is the first way to stick an arrow to a moving car in Filmora 11 by the way, you can also create an arrow in the text editor also. Okay, so let's click OK. And if you want to create your own arrows, all you need to do is to go to the title tab. And then you want to select the basic folder. And then you can use this one, the default folder. Just drag and drop it onto the timeline. And then right click at the title box on the timeline. Select advanced edit. Okay. And then you want to delete this tag, just select it on the timeline and press the delete button. Now you can click here to add a shape and then select this arrow. This is the arrow and you want to delete the text inside. And you can also change the background color and the 
the model of the arrow also right here at the customize folder okay just scroll down and now we have the shape field color just select it and then click more maybe I can select this one okay and I can also increase the shape border here the thickness of the border and also click here to resize the arrow and make it smaller and make it more like an arrow okay and we can also rotate it to put it right here for example just put it here and then we can click OK and the next thing we want to use the motion tracking of the clip and to add the arrow to the to the clip okay to do that all we need to do to double click at the video again and then we want to click this menu and select the default title so this is the name of the new arrow just click here and then you want to move it to the car something will look like this and let's hide this arrow okay and let's play it Ooh, very big arrow follow the car all right that's nice right uh, but if you want to add some motion to the arrow maybe you can add a transition here at the beginning of the the, the title box okay for example you can just click here go to the transition and then you can select any transition right here for example the push one just drag and drop it at the beginning of the arrow and shorten the duration of the transition and let's play it all right so that is how to stick an arrow to a moving car in Fimura 11. i hope this tutorial is helpful for you if it is just click the like button and subscribe to my channel for more video like this thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video goodbye